any question. As a, as a 16 year old, I was almost a member of the Pasadena Rocket Society, so I knew what all the references were. Except I would have had to take a bus for an hour and three quarters to get to and from the meetings. And if I didn't drive the other days, I wasn't going to make my dad drive to Pasadena. So uh, when I when Mondo Hollywood is a statement by the people who are in the movie about Hollywood, the Hollywood in their mind. To take a Pinchon novel about Hollywood, written before you were born, so you don't have a frame of reference of having been there, and to try to translate it with actors, none of whom were alive at the time, is a very, very difficult task. And uh, the the uh, overall, the, the marijuana uh, used throughout the film, basically, uh, it was there. I didn't film it. You know, I, I was invited to acid sessions. You want to come film an acid session? I said, okay, I've never filmed an acid session. So I showed up with my 35 millimeter cameras and my four sun guns. All my equipment was in the trunk of my 65 foot gun with the van. And I had one assistant to help carry stuff. Uh, otherwise, I did it all my own little hands. And um, I got to the party, and I watched the people, and I realized it was all in their head. There was nothing physically to see. They were seeing, but there was nothing I could film. Uh, the the uh, special effects that I stuck in uh, with vinyl cut or something at the end of the, in the dance sequence, uh, that's a technical that I, I only assume that's something like what people saw in the car. I don't really know. <laughs> to do what you did, to take a novel about a period long past and to try to visualize it and to capture the flavor of it is extremely difficult. I think you did it. I hope that the publicity department, Warners, knows how to let the public know about it. <laughs> I saw the trailer on it. I don't think the trailer really captures the essence. It seems very clean and nice. But I, I, think, I think what you got, you got a great effort. I think you got into the soul of what was happening. Through, through the support of your film. And we, we, I keep talking, we let you talk all night. I mean, it's really amazing. But we've got to wrap it up because we've got to get ready for the next show. I'm getting that. Yeah. <laughs> um, thank you very much for coming here. Yeah!